The Warden Sea, also known as the Wattenmeer in German, is the largest tidal flat system in the world and is listed as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. It stretches along the coasts of Germany, Denmark and the Netherlands. The German Warden Sea is divided into three parts, the Schleswig-Holstein Warden Sea, the Lower Saxony Warden Sea and the Hamburg Warden Sea. All of these are in protected national parks. The One Sea is UNESCO World Heritage because of its great biodiversity. All the different animals and plants live here in a very unique ecosystem, but you can't see them at first glance. You have to look a little bit further, um, and then you can find mussels, worms, and even plants like algae. The Warden Sea also plays a significant role in the survival of migratory birds that use the East Atlantic Flyway. The location of the Warden Sea allows water birds to refuel prior to either long-distance flights to high Arctic breeding grounds or to southern wintering grounds. It provides a large network of breeding and feeding sites like salt marshes, dunes, wetlands and mudflats. As with every ecosystem, the Warden Sea faces dramatic challenges due to climate change. Because of the rise of the sea level, the tidal flats shrink. And that's a big problem because all the birds, there's not enough food provided for them. So if you want to help the Warden Sea and protect it, you have to do anything to prevent climate change or minimize the effects of climate change. You can do that by yeah, everything we already know, like um, go by bike and by bus instead of the car. Don't produce as much waste as we're doing at this time. The birds, for example, they eat the trash and they die because they think they have a full stomach, but it's full of plastic. And inform other people about what's happening here and in like every part of this world. Um, that the ecosystems are threatened by us um, and they can't do anything about it, but we can do.